Orange County's second largest city could get even bigger. Leaders in Boca Raton will consider annexing five neighborhoods, including about 700 people, to the city. News Channel 5's Boca based reporter Charlie Keegan found out those potential newcomers have a lot of questions. A lot's changed in the 18 years since Dana Stamler moved into his house. The jog road was one lane in each direction. And just like the road expanded, soon Boca Raton's city limits might expand to include his house. Newport Bay Club is one of five neighborhoods the city is considering annexing. I think the whole uh, perception of Boca Raton is positive. I think it could only be uh, uh, good for the home values. But he and others who live around here have a long list of questions. Will taxes go up? Will police and fire response times change? In that area. Boca City Council members got a briefing on the annexation today. They'll formally start the process tomorrow. Mayor Susan Haney believes the fire and police services would improve in these neighborhoods and throughout the city. Uh, because we'll be adding additional uh, public safety personnel to, to uh, monitor and patrol these areas, that will bring up the level of service for our existing residents. As for taxes, the mayor wanted to assure potential new residents their taxes will remain about the same. It's pretty much a wash for those individuals. The city initiated this process and stands to gain about $700,000 in tax revenue every year. It'll be up to Stamler and about 700 others to vote in November on whether they'll become part of the city. In Boca Raton, Charlie Keegan, WPTV News Channel 5.